round three of the side-by-sides here at Coach High Rally Australia. And the winners in the Polaris. Well done, Cody Crocker, Greg Folletta. What a fantastic run on some really awesome roads for you guys. Definitely. You know, there's some fantastic stuff there. Lots of jumps. I heard all the ARC guys whinging and complaining that it was all too <laughs> rough and jumpy. So we sort of, uh, we liked that. We absolutely loved it. So it was, it was a good run. Nice and smooth and, and good for us. You know, didn't make any mistakes. And, uh, and, uh, and, the, and this thing was absolutely faultless. So awesome. He was sort of faultless as well. <laughs> I have to give him some credit. He did, some, did pretty well with the notes. I hate it when they're that good. They make no mistakes. Greg, well done again, mate. But that's good for the championship. You needed that. Yeah, absolutely. We just more points in the bag. So it's three heats um, this weekend. So it's a bit bigger than the other rallies. So to um, to put together the three heat wins is uh, is going to help us a lot for Rally Victoria. Hopefully we can get it all signed up in one day and <laughs> relax on the second day. <laughs> well, it takes the pressure off yeah. because it's never done till it's done in this, and it is close. The side by side, you guys drive within an inch of their life, don't you, Coach? Yeah, and and we had that. Troubles obviously in South Australia, so we didn't get as many points as we wanted. So now we've got to keep pushing on and make sure we stay in front of Guesty. You know, every event he's actually finding something yeah. to come back at us with, and, and a few stages there he actually was you know, right on us. So we sort of thought, geez, we can't we can't cruise here. We've got to got to keep going flat out. Michael Guest and David Green in the Can Am second. That's a great result, but I know you wanted one more. Not to be this weekend, mate. Yeah, no, not this weekend. Look, we had a great battle here last year with Cody and uh, we were able to win. But no, look, they, they deserved it. Um, you know, they, they had more pace than us and uh, we were just, uh, we couldn't get near them. Uh, fantastic job. Our car ran ab absolutely faultlessly and well, it was second on every forest stage. And I uh, got a little bit closer to the boys on some stages when it suited our car a little bit more, but just not quite there. But exciting news with the new Maverick coming out next year, it'll be a turbocharged car, so these guys have got a power advantage over us at the moment and then we'll probably leapfrog them just a little bit for next year, so that'll certainly help even the competition up. And Dave, it's always on, isn't it? I mean, the guys hang off your notes, they're all committed in this championship, aren't they? Yeah, for sure, it's, you know, 100% commitment, and especially when, you know, we're trying to chase Cody and he's a little bit faster, so it's 100% from the start line right yeah. to the finish. I can tell that you just see the car and the way they move, and the, the fact they are all very reliable, aren't they? Oh, look, for sure. And I think it doesn't matter whether it's the, the, you know, the tip of the WRC, side-by-side, -side, classics, ARC, whatever it is. But if, if you've got drivers with experience who really wanted something bad, and I know Cody wants it, we want it, so that the battle's on. And, and, uh, and look, chasing him hard this weekend, it's good for my driving, keeps me sort of right on the edge. And, uh, yeah, we're, we're looking forward to uh, you know, some closer competition next year. Phil and Dave, you're getting a hard time, but third place, who cares? That's fantastic. Yeah, bugger it, mate. Um, for an old fella, I reckon I've done pretty good <laughs> as a standing driver as well. I mean, what else can you ask for? So, oh, mate, we're really great. Really pleased. It's been two years since my last rally. Um, Ian, my normal driver, was, you know, wasn't able to be here. He's uh, having his bucks party. We still don't know where he is. Um, but, yeah, it was really good. I was really pleased. I chased Michael all day. You know, couldn't quite catch him, but I'm really pleased with third. That was awesome. These machines are unbelievable on these roads, aren't they? Yeah, the... Um, the, the water didn't put us off at all. Like we, we get sprayed a bit, and yeah, it's quite fast through the, through some yeah. of the tight sections. Yeah, yeah, quite fast through the some of the tighter sections. I was quite surprised with the times that we, we end up setting. So uh, now with the great result on the podium, does Ian get a Guernsey back, mate? Or you reckon you might have a crack at Victoria? Uh, no, I think Ian can have it back. But <laughs> the highlight of my rally was knocking Cody off on the special stage. He still hasn't lived that down. So you know, to have the fastest uh, time on the special stage that made my night. All right. Woo! <laughs> Woo!